everyone. Good morning. My name is Alice, and uh, I would like to welcome you to my channel. Um, today is December the fourth, two thousand twenty, and uh, this is my playlist for the Laughter Club. And I would like to thank you for being here. Join me in our laughter session. Thank you so much. Today I would like to uh, share with you a uh, inspiring, uh, remarkable uh, woman. She uh, is a Japanese lady. Uh, she was born and raised in Japan and uh, she did uh, attend uh, to uh, art school in Tokyo and uh, I'm not sure when she went to Brazil immigrate to Brazil but uh, she did eventually and then uh, she raised my friend and her um, sister in Sao Paulo and uh, what's remarkable about this uh, lady is that uh, on her 70th birthday she decided to do something different every single year something that she never done before and some challenge uh, for that year. On her first year, she uh, started practicing and training to run because she wanted to participate in a very uh, famous uh, marathon that we have in Sao Paulo at the end of the year. On December 31st, many participants uh, go run into this marathon. It's called San Silvestri. And um, she uh, practiced and trained the entire year so she would be uh, okay not fading uh, during that uh, marathon. Because December, <laughs> it's uh, in the midst of the summer in Sao Paulo, in Brazil. And uh, she did well. She ended the whole thing and uh, she was very, very happy and uh, very satisfied with her accomplishment, as she should be. On her second year, she decided to do, uh, to learn how to work with metal. She uh, wanted to know how to uh, melt and mold and uh, produce beautiful things with metal. And she did some jewelry, necklaces, uh, bracelets and um, rings. And um, she dedicated the entire year to learn and uh, play with it. I'm not sure what she did on the next, uh, the following years, but uh, last year, apparently, she just uh, <laughs> parachute jumped. And that is amazing. I don't think I would dare to do that. I am too coward to do that. <laughs> and I have no interest in doing that neither. <laughs> but uh, it is something that uh, for us this can inspire and uh, motivate every one of us to do something in a smaller scale every single day it is not that difficult <laughs> right <laughs> and uh, I hope this inspires you and uh, I would like to finish with a quote. It's from uh, Roald Dahl. I'm not sure how to pronounce his name. He is a writer and she wrote a children's book uh, such as Matilda and uh, The Witches. And the quote says, those who don't believe in magic We'll never find it. 
I do hope that uh, you are aware that today is indeed the best day of your life and uh, I hope that you find somewhere in your heart that little kid that used to believe in Santa Claus, in angels, in fairies, in the power of the universe. When we do something different every day, we open a channel in our heart for the unknown. And once this channel is opened, miracles start happening in our lives. And uh, miracles start with magic. So I really hope that you can find that little kid that used to believe in magic so you can start manifesting miracles in your life. So this is my little thinking for today. <laughs> Shall we start our session now? <laughs> for joining me until the end and uh, I hope you all have a beautiful day full of miracles and uh, I will see you tomorrow <laughs> thank you again bye